we're turning our eye towards the Sunset State, Florida. Florida is located on the southeastern coast of the United States and it borders both Georgia and Alabama. On the east side of the state is the Atlantic Ocean and on the southwest end, you'll discover the Gulf of Mexico. A whole bunch of us who didn't grow up in the United States might assume that Miami is the capital city of the state. After all, it definitely gets the most worldwide attention. But the capital of Florida is actually Tallahassee, the city that's almost as difficult to spell as it is fun to say. If you're ever lucky enough to find yourself living down here, you'll enjoy housing costs that are generally lower than most other parts of the country, not to mention world-class beaches, warm weather all year round, and even more enticingly, especially if you're a millionaire celebrity. No state income tax. How's it going guys and gals? It's Kara the Vampire Slayer here for you with a brand new episode on Famous Entertainment. So prepare yourselves for the top 10 celebrity homes in the state of Florida. From actors to rappers to some of the richest people in the world, everyone apparently loves living in a state that almost never sees a flake of snow all year round. Your first. J-Lo! <laughs> Hey, Ron. <laughs> if I'm in Boston, it's not that. If I'm in New York, it's like, hey, Ron. We'll start things off strong with the superstar couple whose nicknames just roll off your tongue, J-Lo and A-Rod, otherwise known as Jennifer Lopez and Alex Rodriguez. When Alex was just a youngster, his family packed up their belongings where they were living in Manhattan and moved to Miami, Florida, where Alex would attend both high school and university. So this is something of a homecoming for him. And J-Lo, well, she also formerly owned real estate in Florida. Together, they purchased a lavish estate for $40 million on Miami's celebrity pack Star Island. Built in 2003, this waterfront estate spans an acre of well manicured grounds and features a Spanish style mansion and guest house that together contain 10 bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, plus two powder rooms in 15,000 square feet of space. Which, considering the type of entourage both of these gigantic stars must bring with them everywhere they go, probably gives them just enough space. Yeah, like, are you ever tired of this? Do you ever feel like, like, okay, I've had enough? Um, not to this point. Number nine on our list is another couple and the man who just punched his ticket to his 10th Super Bowl, Tom Brady and Giselle Bündchen. After leaving New England to join forces with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, Tom and his supermodel wife Giselle moved down to Florida last year. We took a look at the $29 million mansion that Tom and his wife moved into during a house tour episode, but for those of you who have forgotten, that home is located in the wealthy Tampa Bay district, known as the Davis Islands, and was formerly owned by Derek Jeter. More recently, however, there have been reports that Tom and Giselle moved on and into a $7.5 million dollar home in Clearwater, Florida. If you take just one look at this place, it'll be pretty clear why they moved. With its breathtaking modern design and luxurious amenities, that will hopefully entice Tom to stay in Tampa for years to come. It includes a state-of-the-art home theater, custom breakfast bar, and full-on home automation system. Now go get your seventh ring, Tom. You were, you were like the youngest person to become a billionaire. Is that right? For, yeah. Yeah, in terms of my own, earning it on my own, yeah. Right. From a famous celebrity pairing to one of the absolute richest celebrities, Bill Gates comes in at number eight on our list. When you think of that Florida sunshine, odds are you might not think of Bill, who spends most of his time living in Washington state, but he actually owns a bunch of land in Wellington, Florida, and he reportedly purchased it primarily for his daughter to boost her equestrian aspirations on the show jumping circuit. This four acre property has a swimming pool, four bedrooms, and luxurious finishes, as well as a 20 stall barn, paddocks, and schooling area for horses. Bill spent $8.7 million in this estate, which is basically $1 million spent for each acre of land. But considering he's worth $133 billion, I think he can handle it. It's getting to be that time, so cue the music. Next up is John Cena. After becoming one of the biggest stars in WWE history and carrying the company on his back for well over a decade, John is spending a lot more time in Florida these days, in between movie roles and the odd reappearance on the show that made him a crossover sensation. John moved to a gated community in Land of Lakes where his enormous house has actually been seen on display pretty often in television series like Total Bellas, especially the home's remarkable swimming area. The estate has everything you'd expect from a 
superstar who climbed to the top of his game, including a cigar room and a guest house that's so large, it's the same size as Nikki Bella's sister's house in Aberdeen, Washington. These days, John and Nikki Bella are a thing of the past, but John recently got married to his wife, Shay, in the city of Tampa, just 20 miles south of his amazing home. You were at your home here, obviously, before the game to kind of prepare yourself for this moment? Uh, I just, I, I brought some of my teammates over the house to enjoy Miami. Is there any sports athlete more popular in the state of Florida than Dwayne Wade? He is next at number six. Not only did this inevitable Hall of Famer help bring the city of Miami three championship rings and five finals appearances over his career, he also became a mainstay in his adopted state. You should totally stay in my house in Miami. What? I'm serious. Come by anytime. Just let yourself in. It's Dwayne Wade's house. More recently, Wade is actually looking to move off his property in Florida as he spends most of his time living in LA where his wife Gabriel Union works and we previously did a house tour on them as well. But back in 2010, right before tearing up the league as a member of the Big Three, we dropped $10.6 million on this 12,000 square foot beauty of a home. It features six bedrooms, dark wood accents, as well as an outdoor basketball court and gigantic pool. I didn't want to live a one day life. I wanted to live a this is the day life that I want to enjoy. I want to live life to the fullest. With gorgeous weather 24 hours a day, you know, except during hurricane season, a whole bunch of athletes call Florida home. Halfway through our list and another one is Tim Tebow. Tim first purchased a home for $1.4 million in Jacksonville in 2014 and he wound up loving the place so damn much that he doubled down and bought a second house, not only in the same city, but on the very same golf course too. This one for just under $3 million. This former NFL quarterback is spending his retirement in this two-story, 8,300 square foot property that was built in 2006 and is situated on top of 1.49 acres of land. It also features five bedrooms and five and a half baths, along with a 120 bottle wine cellar, a gym, a home theater, and a formal dining room big enough for a seating area and a grand piano. Who better to welcome us to Florida than Flo Rida? Yeah. What, 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 what's the best thing about Florida, man? Oh, man, you know, definitely, um... Being born and raised here. How could I make a list of celebrities living in Florida and not include the man who loves the state so much he named himself after it? Flo Rida, who's obviously a Florida native, purchased his producer's former home here in 2018 for around $1.4 million. After originally buying the house for only 500 k in 2012, his producer tore down what was already there and rebuilt the home that stands there today, taking the overall construction to the next level. This 7,198 square foot home now features five Five bedrooms, five baths, two pools, both an indoor and outdoor jacuzzi, as well as an outdoor basketball court that would make number five on our list proud. Qantas always had uh, the biggest mystique for me. I've always intrigued by the airline, and then simply by coincidence, I bought an ex Qantas 707, which is the one you're filming me on. A whole bunch of famous folk live in Florida because of the amazing skyline, but few take advantage of it more than our number three celeb on this list, John Travolta. In case you guys don't know, my man Johnny is a certified pilot many times over, and he and his late wife Kelly Preston moved to the Jumbo Air Aviation Estates, a residential air park near Ocala, Florida in the early 2000s. This neighborhood features its own private airport that's surrounded by homes, and John, who regularly flies a Boeing 707, has his own tax way that leads to the runway. His wife Kelly once told Architectural Digest that it was always John's dream to be able to pull up to his house in a plane, and by living here, John was able to turn that dream into a reality. Besides that gigantic selling point, and really, what more do you need? This 7,000 square foot home also features five bedrooms, as well as five and a half baths, not to mention floor to ceiling windows all throughout the house that provide that type of fantastic view you would expect from an aviation lover. Uh, yeah, yeah, what's up? This Wheezy Wee. And me and my pa about to show y'all what we call home. Nearing the end of our list and the number two celebrity who lives in Florida is another famous rapper, none other than Lil Wayne. He formerly owned an epic property in Miami with features like a shark tank and skate park and currently lives in a new mansion here. Lil Wayne's Miami estate spans over 10,000 square feet with seven bedrooms and perks like movable glass walls for gorgeous open air spaces throughout. Wheezy's lavish house cost him $17 million and with a moat-like entrance, the home is designed to feel as if it's floating on water. All right guys, I've been saving the best for last. Coming in at number one on our list of celebrities in Florida, 
is the people's champ himself, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Four o'clock in the morning, I wake up, have my caffeine. Four o'clock in the morning. By the way, that's the magic hour. That four o'clock in the morning is when no one else is up, so no one else is bothering you, and you can focus on whatever work you have to get done. Dwayne's ties to Florida go back to his university days when he played football for the University of Miami. Since making it big as one of the most popular wrestlers of all time, and parlaying that into a Hollywood career that would make the most classically trained thespians blush, The Rock has become one of the most popular celebrities in the entire world. And while he owns homes in Los Angeles and Virginia, none of them fit his personality better than his estate located in Southwest Branches, Florida. Now you're probably wondering, what kind of house does a man the size of The Rock live in? Well, this kind. Dwayne bought this home in 2012 from former Miami Dolphin Vernon Carey for $3.4 million. The house is Mediterranean in design and features tons of dark wood throughout which stands in contrast to the white marble that many of the floors are carved from. It also features an iron paradise for Dwayne to get all his reps in without having to leave the comfort of his own home. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up our list of the top 10 celebrities that live in Florida.